so if someone said you know four thousand rand that's not a lot of money i agree it's not a lot of money <laughs> my intention changed my life <laughs> hey guys welcome back to my channel if this is your first time i am Rehudile and this is my channel thank you for watching my video if you're not already please subscribe if you like my content and if you're a returning subscriber welcome back thank you for watching again so in this video i'll tell you guys just a short story about what my 4000 rand internship 4000 rand a month internship got me and where i am today i got an internship with um, the water research commission's graduate employability program um, so i've spoken about this program before on my channel if you want to find out more about this program please <laughs> i'll leave the video up here but you can go and check out my previous videos and you'll see it i'll also leave a link to that video in the description box so i got an internship with the water research commission's graduate employability program it was initially supposed to just be like a six month internship and like i said the pay was <laughs> four thousand rands a month and I know I just wanted to talk about this because I've heard someone recently and not even just one person I've been hearing more and more people you know having the conversation around whether you should or whether you shouldn't accept or even apply for internships that are offering you know 4,000 rand 3,000 rand less whatever whatever internships are offering and how everyone says it's not a lot of money it's not a lot of money and honestly i'll say it's not about the money it's about the experience i will say it becomes about the money if you have to move let's say you're from durban and then you have to move to cape town for an internship that will pay you 2000 rand then it's about the money because you'll be <laughs> you'll have to support yourself in cape town which is an expensive place to live in and you can't really survive with 2000 rand so if the maths doesn't make sense then you know it's not a good idea but this with this internship it placed me you know next to home it ideally places you in the in the town that you listed as your home address in your application so for me it was just just a, it it made sense to do um to be part of the internship also i was finishing school that year and it was a great opportunity what my four thousand rand a month internship got me is got me a lot of experience it helped me to meet other people it exposed me to a different way of thinking to a different um industry that i knew existed but i didn't know to what extent that industry existed so the conservation sector and how intricate and how important a role ngos and conservation um, organizations play in our um, natural environment so it exposed me to that it helped me to appreciate that it gave me something to look forward to it gave me experience it helped me not to become just you know unemployed and really really stressing about what i was gonna do next and it helped me to get my next job which i got at the company where i was placed when my internship ended and i got a better salary at that company i had a position you know as much as i was on contract i i was still getting paid i was still going to work every day keeping my mind busy being challenged mentally meeting people working with people working in the in the natural environment working with other ngos um being part of big projects it just it exposed me to so much so in this video i just wanted to say don't close yourself off to the idea of applying for these internships that you see have low pay especially if it's a place that's near you or near home where you could live at home and then go to work don't close yourself off to that um opportunity because it could really really change your life in a really positive way and from my contract job that i got from the organization i got my permanent job at the big four 
which is where I am now. So if someone said, you know, 4,000 rand, it's not a lot of money. I agree, it's not a lot of money. <laughs> and then from 4,000 rand, I went up. And then from my contract salary, I went higher. So from this job, I can only... You know, I can only imagine that it's just going to keep getting better and better. But I did say in the video where I spoke about what I earned as a graduate, you know, with an MSc in geohydrology, what I was earning at the time. And I did say it would only get better and better. And it's honestly just been getting better and better. So don't frown on the opportunity if you have it. And it's not going to cost you a thing take the opportunity it might change your whole life my intention changed my life i'm not speaking for everyone i'm speaking for me this is my channel thank you <laughs> so if if you listen to everything that i said in this video then you'll understand what i said and i hope you know if you get an internship and it's not going to cost you money you know to take it or to do it that you take the internship you take that opportunity you learn as much as you can and you're just eager you know as much as we've studied we've studied and we thought you know we'll end up working making big money it doesn't always start like that and it's okay if it doesn't start like that it's really okay it just takes time and with time you'll appreciate that humble experience that humble beginning and yeah so that's what my four thousand rand a month internship got me it got me to my permanent job and if you found that story motivational check out my video where i talk about the graduate program i was placed in because it does accept um, people who've studied a whole lot of different things so it might just be the, the the graduate program or the internship place or you know place for you to apply to also and if you apply i hope there's a host company near you that will be willing to take you on and change your life like my host company changed mine so thank you for watching this video um please subscribe to my channel if you have any comments or anything you'd like to say please leave it in the comment section down below as always please keep your comments respectful this is a happy place positive optimistic all the good things so i'll see you in my next video bye I don't